A spokesperson for the company says that the accuser described inappropriate sexual behavior throughout 2014 and because of the seriousness of the accusations, together with information that it may not be an isolated incident, NBC decided to terminate Lauer's contract. We can add one more name to the growing list of high-profile media figures who have been felled by allegations of sexual harassment and sexual misconduct. Today we found out that NBC has fired longtime Today Show host Matt Lauer. With more, here's Brad Hunter. Monday, the allegations came out. Monday evening, uh, Tuesday, he was fired. Wednesday, he's off the air. Iced. Boom. It's interesting because it's been... Um, a memo came out on Tuesday evening from the president of NBC. There was some suggestion that this, even though one um, colleague had made the allegations, there had been suggestions that there was more evidence that this has happened um, before. Yeah, it came out today in the New York Post that uh, the 2014 Sochi Olympics in Russia, that he had sexually assaulted a young NBC staffer. Now, NBC is taking this matter so seriously that they're not waiting for an investigation. They, t they found the woman so credible that that was it. And this is uh, one of those things that media outlets do immediately to protect the brand. Um, but it's, it's a, as I said before, it's a growing list. Charlie Rose at CBS, Bill O'Reilly at Fox News. There's been um, Mark Halperin again at, at NBC Garrison and Keeler NBC. this morning. And, and this, is, this is becoming, um, you know, sort of a who's next sort of situation. But you spent a lot of time in New York. You used to write for the New York Post. Uh, does any of this surprise you? No, not at all. I mean, I was a lone lowly print reporter and I would get hit on all the time and, and it's it's a place where people go to have you know make dreams come mm -hmm. true and that puts a lot of people particularly young women in yeah. extremely vulnerable positions uh, you know vis-a-vis -vis very powerful men big blow for NBC of course Matt Lauer was one of their institutions last I checked they were paying him nearly 25 million dollars a year for his franchise um, but another high profile media figure was is Katie Couric and back in 2012 she had suggested that uh, what we have found out about today may not be so uh, surprising no there were whispers about Matt Lauer's uh, you know behaviors and indiscretions for many years including when I was there and uh, you know his wife you know had sued him for divorce for cruel and inhumane treatment and so the supermarket tabloids has, have been on his sexual antics for a number of years as well so none of this is new all right we will continue to follow this now that the floodgates are open you have to still wonder who will be next